CC, we've been using uh, Mastercam for about two years since we decided to bring our CNC processes in-house. Uh, we moved into the transition into Mastercam X when that came out and is staying up with the current revisions of that. Uh, it's always easy to get support from Mastercam, whether it's calling our local distributor or uh, corporate headquarters direct. Always easy to get somebody knowledgeable on the phone quickly that can help us through whatever, whether it be a post-processing problem, a geometry problem, a toolpath problem. Uh, it's been a great support network for us, helping us out get up and running, and uh, I look forward to that continued support in the future. One of our newest pieces of CNC equipment is the Flow 5-axis water jet system. And uh, when we got this piece of equipment, one of the first things we did, really jumped in feet first, came up with this design for a bike where we were taking our solid fender blanks and wanted to cut these flames from the tank. You can see it's a fully 3D surface tank. Um, so what we had to do was find a way to keep the water jet on the end of this robotic arm normal to the surface through all this cutting and always keep that head close up. Since we had designed the gas tank uh, using SolidWorks and programmed in Mastercam, we were able to take that geometry, do a sketch on surface to create the flame cutout, and then program this machine here using Mastercam X to do a five axis swarf tool path always staying normal to this surface and cut this flame job off the tank. What we did next was take this metal flame which will conform to a tank and have that piece chromed and reapplied it to a high gloss black painted uh, gas tank that was solid. Gave us a, a beautiful effect, a little richer than the paint might be and uh, very few people would be able to accomplish uh, a project like this without having the use of a, of a machine like this and Mastercam to program it. In our machine shop, we have several uh, Haas CNC machining centers. Right here on the VM3, we are running a part. It's a uh, motorcycle safety and security device called a Roadlock. One of our vendor partners uh, has the design, and we're making a custom Roadlock device to go on our production choppers. Uh, so this is the Roadlock device that we're using. Axle goes through here, brake calipers mount here. Uh, these are the bolts where the locking pin and key switch would go. Roadlock logo engraved in. Uh, again, this piece was machined completely here in about 25 minutes from raw billet aluminum that had been cut to shape. Grab a part over here. Uh, you can see when we started off, we had a part water jet out from three inch thick billet aluminum. Programmed to run on the first side. Fixture it up on the second side. We end up with a completed part. This part's ready to go out for chrome now. When it comes back, we'll install the, the bolt and the key switch. And ready to put on a bike. This particular product was designed completely in Mastercam, programmed using Mastercam. Uses a bunch, uh, several different 
uh, machining applications. Uh, we're using pocketing, uh, some undercut contour milling. Uh, we have some boring going on and uh, drilling and contouring. So we really put MasterCam to use on it and the, the parts that are coming out are coming out wonderful.